Avalanche Gang, you probably want to ban. I was going to ask which one. <laughs> I think, I think, who do you think, Charlie? So, since we started this, I have so far <laughs> looked up how to get with Baron. <laughs> I have. You mean Greta T? Made us, I have made us spend three minutes renaming Baron because I didn't like the name you chose. And I've been very weird about Baron. So clearly, it's Wedge. It's Wedge. Epic Wedge moment. It's a Wedge moment. Wedge is a literal king. He's a chunky boy. <laughs> he's, on our, he's on our slash chunkers. Uh, Sorry. You <laughs> apologize. Now. <laughs> no. Look <laughs> how much I fed Wedge, guys. He's, he's gonna he's die. On, <laughs> he's on two strokes, but look, I got an upvote on r slash chunkers. It was all worth it. He's looking around. He knows that he knows that Peter are coming for him. <laughs> In the south, I'm gonna come and beat him. <laughs> <laughs> Ralph, you like um, <laughs> Ralph, you like uh, Flarka in um. Okay, so we need to. Middleton, what's that for? Why did he do a pointless I... roller? Because Wait, he's broly. Sh... Look, look at that! Look at that! They were walking out. Why just getting an additional exercise? Because he's just so obsessed with getting his perfect muscular physique. Ah uh, yes. Hey, hey. Spend your money, wait till we get back. Poor Greta. Mm. I think Greta was cool. I think she's pretty cool. I mean, she, 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 she went has, on the boat. She has a Gatling gun for an arm. She threatened Donald <gasps> Trump with... <laughs> <laughs> Look at the clones! <laughs> wait, how did he get there? Excuse Sorry, me. Sorry, but it's because in, in the, uh, in the, um... In the... You better get out of here. In the I, animated I song. Know. In the animated song, they say he got shot out of or something. I was gonna just imagine him getting shot out the top of the reactor. No, that's ridiculous! I look at the four people <laughs> who look exactly the same. This is literally the Clone Wars. Why could he get shot? See, I always thought he would like, get shot out of the reactor, and I'm really disappointed that that didn't happen. I should probably... No, fuck it. Rav, should we fight Ebner? No, I've fight been, I've been lied to by, um... By... It's a Game Grumps guy, Ego Raptor. Oh, okay. Yeah. No, it wasn't... Ego which one's he? It was, it was it was it was Danny Sexpan. Was he was he Dan or Aaron? Which one's Dan? Is Aaron, Dan, Aaron Dan's... is Ego Raptor, right? And Dan yeah. is the Danny yeah, Sexpan. Okay. He made he used to actually be. I <laughs> don't like I don't like where this is going. He's surrounded by men in the same uniform. Oh dear. Oh that... dear. It's... it's the um it's the crash it's the the with the... It's the scientists. <laughs> it's the you know. I've created Deviant Part Crash. And you are my first victim. Look. Broly never came. <laughs> Broly. I think he was killed. This is actually what happens in the movie. Now they don't have to pay him. That's what Barrett's Broly. thinking. He's just thinking... I don't have to pay him. You know, he got out of paying Cloud, so... That was probably his plan all along. Say, so, do you think Broly's gonna stay and fight for... Devil Edge? How the hell would I know? Do I look like a man reader? Hmm, <laughs> for screw-ups. <laughs> oh, nothing, sorry. We don't make money, Evan. How was Avalanche making money, actually? What do they do to um, make money? So, like, this stuff must be expensive. Are they uh, being funded? Uh, is, uh, is China funding Avalanche? No, is Wu Tai is. Putin? It's actually, what if Wu Tai is funding Avalanche? Actually, Damn apparently, right. it's, apparently, it's literally Rufus. Oh. Because he used oh. Avalanche to become president. Something. Oh, that's kind of smart. All right, cool. Oh no, like he he had like special like relation. He was like playing them off against someone else and giving them money. I think that's like the deep lore from like, the spin-off games or whatever. Oh, ooh, that's kind of that's kind of deep. It's hey, Charlie, that's a great house. But what if you pretend to be wedge and I'll be big, and then we can uh, we can start a house. <laughs> start a house. Who would be big and wedge in our house? Who who would be who? I don't know. Um. Hmm. Wait, what, what, what's happening here? She's smudging him. I, I like how she's led up to be the love interest and then she gets fucking shot and killed. And squashed by a giant part of a city. Mm, sorry, so I don't know how she would have a cloud over a man like a wedge. <laughs> a woman Wait, like Greta T. Let, let, us, let us compare wedges and clouds surface area to volume ratio for a minute. <laughs> After <laughs> all, that's what a woman looks for in a man. <laughs> Amazing wedge.
That's an increased volume to surface area. It's you. It's just got the was. <laughs> you get more volume per, per centimeter cubed of wedge. You're out. <laughs> what? Subnautica, yay or nay? What do you think of the. Mm, you see, here's the thing I, I, I love Subnautica. I love it so much. Never bloody finished it. Never finished it. I lost two hours of progress on my save and I was so pissed I never finished it. <laughs> That's, <laughs> That's the truth. My old computer just couldn't run it properly. The thing is, you know, I got a computer basically to play some Subnautica and I still haven't played it. Genuinely. The thing is, I was always like, oh, when I get my PC, I'm gonna like stop playing Minecraft, play like Subnautica and high graph. I still play like Minecraft and Terraria. Yeah. I'm playing you know, this! I'm playing this game from 1997 on this new supercomputer. It just goes to show, like, the first one. thing, do you know what the first thing I played when I got this computer was? What? I played an emulated version of Final Fantasy VI. The 1994 huh. 2D one. And that was on your, 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 your top yes. big boy gaming PC. Wow. I did then play Total Impressive. War Attila, which is so fucking poorly optimized. It's oh my insane. god, they've got they've got the they've got the China like um they have like the China citizen gym points thing. What's they it? The social do. credit. They do. Yeah, social credit. Speak of the devil. Oh my god. Charlie, just quickly say nice things about China <gasps> Ralph, it's the famous line. Look you can see the surface now the city you have no day or night. Plate word there we can see the sky. Wow, I sure hope the plate doesn't go at any point. Oh, it's pretty unsettling scenery, huh? Ooh. Why? Oh. Why is? Why is the city covered in a plate in the first place? Um, I don't. I don't. Like, what's the advantage to that? The that because of that f fucking pizza. Like, I can genuinely see. Is there stuff up on the plate? Yeah, like, it's that. That's where the rich people live. Oh. So when they collapse the plate, they also kill loads of rich people. Yeah, that's not great. But the thing is, the point seems to be, you know, to um. To, to, to make the city, you know, to provide more living space. But here's the thing. For what I can see of Midgard, surrounded by a large, you know, rocky open area, right? Yeah. It like is a big fucking yeah. So there's not, it's not exactly a problem of, like, real estate, is there? It's not like they're on, like, an island or something. That's true. It seems really needlessly complex and expensive to build a big-ass plate. When you could just expand outwards. Maybe they're or literally you could... doing it just to be assholes. You ever think of that? That seems like a very expensive, like, like even for Shira, they're not sitting around that board table being like, okay, oh, actually, fair. Oh, yeah, they did, they did drop them. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's actually, you wouldn't see Shira doing anything completely needless just for the sake of it. That is literally all uh, they do. Yeah. To be fair, the plan that. is pretty good. If we find the promised land just overflowing with Mako, we'll have infinite money. Sorry, sorry, so the plan is, that's like me looking at, like, Imagine, imagine me as like the CEO of a, a company, you know, and you're like my um, you're my accountant, you're my financial advisor, and you come into the board meeting one day, and I'm like, hey, look, I found this book of uh like ancient myths, and there's this place called El Dorado, and no one knows if it's real or not, but I've heard there's a ton of gold there, so I think we should invest everything into finding the mythical land of El Dorado. I'll go like. Okay. What do you think about? Do they have any? Do they have any like actual proof the promised land exists? Like um, any any solid concrete stuff. Well, it is a JRPG. That's the only proof. That's not good enough. <laughs> so they have no also, because one, it's written down in ancient legend and whatever. Yeah, but again, El Dorado is written down in like ancient level, ancient no, it legend, wasn't. and like no one apart from like just Bill some... Gates is probably looking for it. It's just some natives. Bill Gates. Just some natives made it up to confuse all the the, co uh, the conquistadors. It's tough to be a god. Dun, 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 dun. The movie's good though. The movie I guess, was good. I guess I that's... haven't fully seen it, but I, I know about it. So that, that was the real El Dorado all along. I just have a, uh, I have the El Dorado game for Game Boy Advance, the cartridge in my drawer, and I don't have never owned a Game Boy Advance. Huh? How did it get there? I think it belonged to my brother, and I think he gave it to me for <laughs> no reason. It is a game you can't play. Have a look at it, nerd.